Hello class, welcome to today's math lesson. Today we're going to be identifying some geometric solids. Each of these geometric solids has its own special name. Let's take a look at this one. Do you know what it's called? Hmm, we often see it looking like this sometimes. It's called a cone. This we might think is called a block, but its special name is cube. We often call these balls, but the name for this geometric solid is sphere. This is a cylinder. This is a rectangular solid. And this one way over here is a pyramid. If you were looking at these, could you find two that have something that's similar? What about these two? Our cone and our cylinder. What do you notice about the bottoms of them? Our cone and our cylinder both have circular bases. Can you find two more that have something similar? What about our rectangular solid and our pyramid? Their bases are both squares. I'd like for you to take some time playing with your geometric solids today and practice using their names. Say them with me. Cone, cube, sphere, cylinder, pyramid, and rectangular solid. Class today, I would love for you to go around your house and to find some real objects that are the same shape as the geometric solids that we learned today. Can you see some items here in my classroom that are the same shape as some geometric solids? Hmm, this one might be an easy one. What geometric shape is this? Did you yell out sphere? I hope so because this is a sphere. What about our die or our dice? What shape would they be? Did you say cubes? Well done. I bet that you can find some cubes around your house or about around your classroom. Hmm. What about my tissue box? What it would be the name of this geometric solid? Is it a rectangular solid? It is, isn't it? It has a square for the bases on each side and then rectangles on the side. Hmm. This, you might need to think about this one for a little bit. What geometric shape would my marker be? Did you say cylinder? Well done. I bet that if you were at home and if you opened up your pantry or cupboard in your kitchen that you would find lots of cylinders and rectangular solids and cubes as well. Oh class, I hope that you have fun going on a geometric shape hunt today. Have fun finding some geometric solids and remember to practice using their very fancy math names that we learned today. Oh class, I hope that you have a wonderful time playing with math today. Bye-bye!